Hi everyone, Jessica here and this video is probably the most important video that I have done so far. And I'm doing it with a fever blister. But I don't care, some things just need to be said. Today I will be talking to you about feminism. And now that I've dropped the F-bomb, some viewers probably switched to another video and those of you who are still watching are probably having some stereotypical thoughts about what I'm going to say or maybe about me as a person. So let's get some of those thoughts out of the way. Thoughts like feminists are angry, we don't wear makeup, we have hairy legs, we are lesbian, we are man-haters. People always say these things like they're bad. I hope you laughed because that was a joke. But seriously though, the only thing that these stereotypes do is they stop people from looking at problems from a different viewpoint. So what is feminism? I actually went out and I asked a few people what they think feminism is. And most of them said, oh, it's about human rights or equality. And it is kind of sad to think that the word feminism has lost its meaning. Because it, feminism might just be the oldest and most powerful social justice movement in the world. So what is feminism? It is the term used for the women's liberation movement. It is liberating women and all of society from a world of patriarchy, where men rule just about everything, even though, according to statistics, there are more women in the world than men. So if we do not believe that men are just naturally the best leaders, then we really have to wonder what the hell has been keeping women back. I think it is structural inequalities, like sexism. So it is big, it is really big, to just start talking about challenging structural inequalities. It is our evolution's start. And that is why feminism is about so much more than just equality. We need to change society. Society doesn't work for a lot of people anymore anyway, and not just women. Feminists have not been fighting and struggling for centuries just for equality with men who are unequal themselves. So equality with whom then? With the men in prison? With men who are victims of violence? Who have been treated unfairly by institutions that were meant to protect them in the first place? Men who are living in poverty? Who are living with mental illness or addiction? Them? Now you might be thinking, of course we don't mean those men. We mean successful men, men at the top, the CEOs. Women should be able to be CEOs as well. And of course, I do agree with that, I support that. But we shouldn't confuse feminism with sex discrimination laws. Feminism is about change. It is not just about replacing a few male CEOs with women and leaving that entire system in which we live and work intact. Because the system is flawed. Actually, no, it is not flawed. It is broken. And women know that. We see that every day. And because we see this every day, us women can often see where what needs fixing. 
And that is why we need to be heard. And that is why feminism is important, because feminism makes our voices heard. Right now, we are living in a society where the system is power is used over people. It is used to keep people down. And there is no future in that. We need to change society by changing the system. So how are we going to do that? We need to break down the system and start rebuilding it from scratch without structural inequalities. So what is feminism? Feminism is anti-sexism. It is anti-racism. It is socialism. It is environmentalism. Because feminism will only be as strong as the connections between all social justice movements. I am a feminist and I will not settle for equality in a world where the system is broken beyond repair.